On to this tutorial, we are going to be looking at Godet, G-O-D-E-T-S, Godet. They are wedge of fabric. It can be in form of a triangle. Right now, people funkified it into an arc shape. Place in between seams. You can place it in between your slit. Godet were used for fullness at that time, but today we're going to be using it to add uh, as an added design. As you can see in those pictures now let's get to work I'm going to be working on my miniature so it's going to be a short I'm going to be using lesser fabric I'm going to be folding this paper into two two folds and we'll come to the edge and I'm going to be putting the waist of the my miniature divided by 3.142 that is a standard number that we use so I'm going to be making a an hack that is four inches all round to make an hack. That is the waist measurement divided by 3.142. Now I move to the length of the skirt. The length of this particular skirt for my miniature is 9.5. So I'm going to be making 9.5 all around in order to have an equal length this method is just for an equal length just to make the length to be equal so i make at interval for a smooth arc Then time to cut, 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 cut out. I notch the middle because the middle to notch the middle is very important. Now I'm trying to measure where I want the goddess to start from. The goddess is going to start from this particular place down to the M line of the skirt. I decided to pick three inches so the goddess is going to start from three inches b after the waist so from the waist i measured three inches you can measure more than that you can decide to go lower you can decide to go higher so i made a semicircle let's say and hack yeah that is it So I'm trying to decide how many goddess, like how many triangular shaped insertion I'm going to be removing. So I decided to look for the middle of the middle. <laughs> that is the quarter of this skirt. All I did was fold once, then fold twice. So from, that is my center back. So from my center back, I measured four inches. That's for my center back. And I make a triangular shaped yes you can actually do curve you can do a curve that's and like an hack but i'm going to be doing the regular triangular here today so i went to the center front and i measured the same amount of inches and i made another triangle large shaped now for the middle of the middle, I decided to, you know, unfold was four. So, and this one is not unfold. So, we're going to be making eight. I did, I made a mistake. I did five. It was supposed to be four, four. Four at the right hand, four at the left hand. So, do not mind what you are saying. It's supposed to be four. And the reason why we are doing 4-4 four, four is because this particular one is not on food, but the rest are on food. So I'm going to be cutting out. When you cut out, we need to we need to be very careful so that we won't miss up the pieces. So I would advise that instead of packing it up like me, you can leave it there or try to label. I did, I think I did at the end of this video, I labeled because I was getting confused too. So after cutting it out, 
I'm going to open it up. So this is opening it up. You can see this is an half circle, a half circle skirt. So I'm was trying to fit it back so that I will, there won't be any mess up. That was the reason why I said you should label. So I started to label. I labeled this XX. So I will know that this X is going into this X. This Y is going into this Y. Then ZZ. <laughs> Yes, why for the um side back I did S O S O. They are the same thing for the center back. You can use either of these pieces. Now let's go to the fabric. Now I for the so the first thing is I'm going to cut the fabric. This fabric I do not joke with my allowance, so I did half inch allowance. This is what I'm going to be using to join back those goddess those pieces those triangular pieces that what we call the goddess so i'm going to be fixing back the goddess into this skirt but i need allowance so that's why i did half half allowance everywhere that the goddess is going to be fixed back in Now, I placed, folded the fabric into two, and I decided, and I put the same allowance, half half, on each each pieces. So I'm going to be cutting it out. So that's what we are doing here. So that's my first one. I think that is the SO. So I didn't cut the last one because I cut that last one on fold. So they are the same thing. So one is okay. You can have more pieces than what I'm having. You can decide to have a lot. If you see that child's picture, it was a lot of pieces. It was everywhere. You can decide to make it everywhere. So I didn't cut that last one because I've cut that one on pieces, on fold. So I will use that particular, the last center back. I'm going to be using, I will use it because it's on fold. I'll use it for both of them. So I'm trying to fit in what I've done. The paper is still with me, so I'm able to understand that. Here we have it. This is a skirt with a pink and purple goddess. So go ahead, let's use our goddess to make lovely design. That is what the channel is for. Using your elementary, elementary knowledge to make beautiful designs. Just it all. You can make it curve. You can do a ruffle at the end of this skirt. Just design and make your own design. Thank you for watching. Please make sure that you practice this. Share, subscribe to this channel. Let's grow this channel. Thank you, everyone. Bye.